Paper Mario Thousand Year Door HD. Let's go. Let's go. What a fun ride that was. Time to do it all over again! Yeah, I mean, we could have waited, certainly, <laughs> but... This looks nice. Mm -mm. Let's go. I'm glad we didn't. Goombella! Wait, the noose! I hope they didn't remove it. They did not remove I it. I hope they didn't noose remove it. Noose the confirmed. The was on top it of it. It was blocking it. Noose confirmed. Noose confirmed. Hmm. News confirmed. All right. As is Death Alley and the fucking and the Sopranos. <laughs> All of it there. Yes. The Meadows. The the, the metal the the, the metal pedals. <laughs> oh, I had to double think. I had to wait, wait, wait. wait. The What's the right one? <laughs> yes. The Poonies and the Jabbies. <laughs> Yeah! It's beautiful. Yep. Blow. Take me with you! Oh, me. hook tail! Yeah, That yeah. was a wild this ride. Looks, this looks great! It's really nice that, you know, we had an advanced access to the HD switch. Right? We hit that HD button. You're ready. Ooh, yo, the remix of the music! <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Oh shit, the music. Ah, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Nice, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Can we get a little, like, stylish in HD update as well? Yeah, yeah. Okay, this is a good one. There you go, news confirmed. Hmm. How many times do we have to re-release these things? This was Rubber for a long K. Time, McMahon. Right? The wrestling arc. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. All right. So. Uh. Ooh. What's this? Oh yeah. Uh oh. Touch. Sweet touch, <laughs> you've almost convinced me I'm real. Oh, yeah, that's cool. They brought it back. That's crazy, simply because I believe half of that LP was spent screaming about how they're never bringing this back. Never, <laughs> never. It was yeah, too wild. Yeah, and yeah, yet. yeah. No, because and and that's why I believe this is how why you have sticker star <laughs> is the, is what we what got clipped in there. There you go, right? There you go. They actually did it. That's cool. It's weird, but it's just like I, I, doing video games literally my whole life and shit. It's like things you want if you just wait long enough, they are gonna happen. They are gonna if it's happen. something that people are kind of talking about, it'll take a while, but it, you know. Like, and there are some big names that are standing out, and you're like, oh. Yeah, Earthbound? like, I, oh, I, at some point, Hellfly? you might be in oh. your 50s when it happens. Quake, oh. I mean, you're like, you know what I mean? Like, that's the thing. You kind of can just stick around, and eventually, at some point, maybe, things just kind of happen. They might take forever to happen, but they kind of do. So, that's also the bit, yeah. where, like, if you're, if you're just kind of, you're like, well... You'll see, you, you'll see it when you see it, then yeah, a Zone of the Enders 3 might pop up sometime in the future, you know? A God Hand might pop up. Who the fuck knows? Because, like, time is long. Life is long. Life Years is go long. by. There's a lot of things, you know? so Sometimes time is a circle. Yeah, it, it does feel like, like, like things do kind of just eventually happen. It just takes forever to get to it. There's also a predictable pattern, which is... As you get to the end of a Nintendo console's life cycle, they start giving you all the remakes you want. <laughs> they, right? They take a new thing and then they put it on the old and the new console and they sell yeah. to both. 
and they go, but here's the new features on the new thing. Twilight Princess. So you're going to want to grow for the new version, right? Compared to the old one, the new one is way hotter. Mm -hmm. And then there's a couple of things that they push that are going to show off the features of the new console. And you wait a while. And on the way out, as they're getting ready to gear up for the Switch 2, they hand you all a couple of remakes you're looking for. Here's your fucking Wind Waker. Here's your what you know what I mean? Like you, you just you start seeing the, the 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 remakes that everyone wants as like the hits, the classics. I see. You get them towards the end of the life cycle, and then you switch it over. Nintendo's been doing this for our entire lives. That's why we're seeing this, and that's why we're seeing Mario RPG. Things that people have been screaming for for over a decade now, right? And Nintendo's like, hold Metroid it. Prime. Hold it. Yeah. All that shit you want. They're like, yeah, 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 yeah. You'll, you'll get it when we're pretty much on the way out trying to sell the last couple few of these before we switch it up. You know, it's, it's a very deliberate thing. So Mario versus Donkey Kong. Is this a new one or is it a remake of the old one? Mario the toys Donkey are Kong, back like in the, town. The ladders and... Do, 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 do. It's a remake Donkey of the GBA Kong. game. Okay, yeah, Mario. yeah, it looks seem, looks like it. The rivalry oh. that heated up on the Game Boy Advance system reignites on the Nintendo oh, Switch system. Oh, did you, you ever? Do you remember this? The there was the little toys, and yeah, it was, it was a puzzle game. Stolen all the mini Mario toys from the oh, factory. I didn't play that. And it's up to Mario to track him down. Yes. Put yeah. the Mario skin on top of anything. Yeah, it, it was it was good. It was fun. Um, it came out at a time when I feel like a lot of other stuff was coming out, so like it might have gotten, you know, like, like it, was, it was a little bit lost in the noise. But um, it was good. And it's again, it's more of a, it's definitely a puzzle game more than a platformer. You know? Now he can get across. But you have to be and in a puzzle game mood, grab the key. right? Platform too high? Reach it with it's a funny how like or a you have the same jumping like mechanics that. and things that like a Mario game asks you to do, avoiding Observe enemies and so on. And but by slowing it down Mario's and making it more focused on like and keys and locks, uh -huh. you change the genre. <laughs> You know, from like I guess like action platformer to like of the game, puzzle platform. You can platformer. play with a friend That's in cute. local co-op. Because the pace is way slower. However, you choose to puzzle your way through. It's up to you. Which they to then recover the toys. kind of figured out in um, Captain Toad. Yeah. With the Mario same kind of thing, right? Donkey so Captain Kong Toad is like taking the Mario Switch 3D Land uh, uh, style today gameplay, but Nintendo slowing it down and making it more puzzle oriented than uh, action oriented. That was a remake or a new? This thing? is a remake. Okay. Yeah. So, okay, <laughs> I wonder if we keep track how many new things will actually come up. Oh, I mean, I exp I'm like most of what we're seeing today is probably <laughs> first party remake. Like, I mean, again, the Switch 2 re rumors are pretty substantial at this point. Okay. There's a lot of people internally that are already working on it and, and uh, have been receiving documentation. So, so this is the remake push that you're, this is, this you're, you're is we're, we're in the moment. <laughs> We saw it last time. We saw it the time before that. They know F zero ninety nine, ninety nine, which looks like the one on SNES. But Tetris ninety nine. Oh, this is how it Mario comes back. Mario ninety nine. This is how it comes back. Do you want to race zero against game. seventy Captain Falcons? Returns as a chaos battle royale. <laughs> F zero Fucking chaos. Sick classic courses with machines from Not the F Zero that Endgame. everyone wanted, Tear but the F Zero you deserved, I suppose. <laughs> but be careful, right? Your power meter will we want a new one crash into pilots with or uh, uh, awesome new zero, designs for the characters and music. But you'll need to avoid a fucking insane ass ninety nine version of this is race. pretty wild too. Also, although Feeling this is the one that is like some of your power the hardest to play. Speed boost. Yeah. Because like the handling on everything is so fucking violent. Super sparks, and like hitting the edge just blows collide. you up. Like <laughs> to boost classic, up to classic F Zero and Super Nintendo. It's really hard. Chance at bypassing what? The rivals oh shit. And jumping into a higher position. Uh. All right. That was no. While you're racing to unlock cosmetic <laughs> that options was for your cheap. machine. Yeah, it, it is basically bumper cars. It is. <laughs> look, look at this madness. 
Wow. All right, well, people are going to have fun. And depending on how technical it is, you might go. Uh, I mean, it's time to race your way to some, first some place. So, so if you're, a, if you're good at the game, like if you're good at Tetris, if you're good at Mario, so like you can do better than the average player. Yeah. But, the, but like today. the battle royale, the level, the amount of bullshit happening on the track right now means your skill is only going to get you so far. Right? There's some other specific shit you got you're gonna have to take into account. <laughs> Alright, the new Princess Peach. <laughs> I just I... So there was a, a Princess Peach before? Uh Super Princess Peach was a <laughs> Nintendo DS game. Um the original. And uh she was in a platformer okay. and there were four touch buttons where they were all like different emotions. And when you touched each one, they would give her a different thing. Like, like you touch the crying button, and then she would tear out. She would cry big, a big bunch of tears, and she'd be pr propelled really far forward by them. Okay. So each button was just girl button. I see. <laughs> you know? What special powers is the girl going to have, right? Mario's got the, the fireball and the tanuki suit was and the Miyamoto's frog. Was idea? Yeah. And, and you know, uh, Princess Peach has uh, the vapors hysterical <laughs> you know? oh my god <laughs> all right just nintendo. the silent treatment you know <laughs> if you think nintendo will change in their ways you're wrong yep read my mind you know and uh that's it so uh we're, we're this is i don't i believe this is not a remake i believe this is a brand new game which we're doing away with those old mechanics but who knows who knows what we'll get? Who knows? I mean, after seeing the movie, One day, I think a uh, we're probably presented a flyer advertising going a little bit further than the, Sparkle Theater. the previous game. Princess Peach and some toads went to go see it, but then... Oh no! The wicked Bal in Wonderworld! The sour Bunch suddenly made their grand entrance and took center stage. God damn it! I thought he was in jail. Now it's up to Peach and the How did he get out? and Stella to save the play. <laughs> How did Eugene Aka break out after his financial crimes? This Peach, you gotta stop him. Has become a terrible tragedy. What's happening? Luckily, Peach can use the power of Stella's ribbon. <laughs> okay. So the one thing I saw was a GIF on Twitter, where someone was like, uh, uh. Boyfriend comes home like, man, what a horrible day. Everything sucks. There's nothing that can make me feel better. I'm so sad. Luckily, Peach can use the power of Stella's rib. <laughs> That's... I, f I hate that I got where you are. That's, That's how much I hate this right now. <laughs> Ribbon to face off against the Sour Bunch. <laughs> oh my god. Hey yo! <laughs> won't always cut it though. So let's do this. <laughs> nice dress. Henshin. Whoa! Peach transformed yo. into Sword Fighter Peach. With a stinger? By transforming, she can use fantastic show-stopping okay, abilities. Okay, that's sick. That's cool. Off that's the sick. Sour bunch with sensational yeah. sword play. So that's that's. I, after the Mario movie, I was can saying Peach like we're probably gonna get that energy continuing. You know the fighter Peach vibes. But it's like okay, we can get rid of the emotion buttons. Oh. But girls still like dress up. <laughs> we're still gonna play dress up. Yeah. <laughs> Costumes, right? You can be anything you want. How fun! Desserts have been snatched from yes. the sweets festival. To be fair, Girls turn love into dress up is awesome. And save it from you a got sugar it, you gotta cook. Look at that! The Let sour cook. bunch got their hands on this martial arts school. Become Kung Fu can't, Peach and take it back from these foul You can't just take on the theme and not commit to the bit. It's like, oh! Baby. Oh, it's like Barbie. She does it all. Many check the, other check those kicks. Are just behind the curtain. The stage right? Is set. Our you don't kick to do damage. You kick spotlight. to hurt both of you to say that don't don't do don't do a leg kick. If Princess you do a leg Peach, kick, it's gonna hurt both of Showtime. us. Showtime makes its debut on Nintendo Switch. Look at that. March twenty second. All right, that looks Pre cute. Pre-orders begin today on oh, Nintendo like like eShop. Yeah. That is cute. Another sequel. That's it. So her style switching is is to combat styles and not to emotions. Tomb Raider Remastered. Wow. Oh yeah. Okay. I played the first one. 
to completion. Um, did not the try first two three Tomb Raider games, yeah. all with How far are we going? visuals, are venturing onto okay. Nintendo Switch in one so, daring collection. Interesting. The fearless archaeologist, Lara They're not Croft, even like fully the world updated. They're just updated to look the way the later games kind of looks. Mm. Like Tomb Raider 4 kind of looked like this. And swan dive through perilous quests spanning different yeah. countries and mythologies. You could do a swan Along dive and way, just break your neck if there was no water on the bottom. Treasures of the it was kind of fucked up. It was really, really messed up. It was just head time. into the ground. This <laughs> master trilogy comes with all of the expansions and secret levels for each game. You can also toggle no between polygonal the original titty. polygon look and the upgraded visuals at any time. Tomb Raider 1 through no, no, 3 no, Remastered, go, go starring Lara Croft, launches on the Nintendo Switch system <laughs> too, February 14th. Too many, too many begin edges. today on Nintendo eShop. Luigi's Mansion 2 HD, the remakes. Ooh, ooh, uh, uh, I've never played Luigi. Oh, before. it's great. It's a lot of fun. I think it's Final Smash and Brawl is used uh, a vacuum, maybe. I don't even remember. Luigi's Mansion 2 HD. Yeah. Welcome to Evershade Valley, a place that's screaming and teeming with the supernatural. Luigi, our faint of heart hero, was sent here to check it out. Time for some mansion mayhem. So he's a big scaredy cat, huh? That's the deal. <laughs> and you suck in no the ghosts. No spooky adventure is complete without Give ghosts this big vacuum suck. like device, the Poltergeist. Now, I haven't played all of them, certainly, Use it not to the light up dark ones, areas, but uh, back in the day, up objects, the first one, and at the very interact least. With the environment. So it's I don't know how novel the gimmicks were escapades. later on. I, I, it it Plus, does feel like a theme a that ghost, could overstay its welcome if they don't find uh, them with the ball. enough then new stuff to do with it. But I really like the first one. You can even grab multiple ghosts at once. Suck him up. In this game, you'll find ghosts haunted. And you know, it's not like a there was a, plant research lab, a Ghostbuster game at the time taking advantage of a it. A broken so. down <laughs> clock factory that's full of sand. A mine covered Nintendo in ice and snow. That there was a need and even more places. Yeah. Also, like, These Luigi having his own game that's not just Mario your path. is a good call, too, right? Like, Can Luigi give it something summon distinguishing his courage and from save the day? I mean, eventually, eventually, we did get a Ghostbusters. Ghost eventually, there was. Can do and then the Ghostbusters that was the Nintendo port was like a, modes. like, cute, sort of Luigi's like SD Mansion version HD that couldn't handle the onto Nintendo Switch Gears of War style summer. other Console. Don't forget the movie. Guide Sargon as he sets off to save the Prince of Persia and restore the world's balance. Real simple, just platform, into wall jump, have Prince fun, and then wow. cool movement, and then the combat. Side scrolling action adventure with the time gameplay. button, if you remember, Dash where you could create an after image and then rewind to it. Mythological Persian inspired world. It's but don't sick. linger too I've long. Only played hope the to survive. First. Prince of Harness Persia. Sword and bow oh. techniques. The, well, not, yeah, not the we, new one. We saw a trailer for this. Old, in old, old, old. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah the old PC one. In the February direct, we saw the uh, the, the reveal of this. I think. And yeah. learn new abilities that expand his arsenal. Equip mm -hmm. amulets to further boost your abilities, among other perks. That's cool. Okay. Yeah. The number of amulets you can equip is limited, though. And so as much as. You know, Use everything at your disposal to as much as indivisible is uh, now and a, a banned word. Stand in your <laughs> I love Get ready the gameplay the of running around discover the mysteries of like Mount levels Cap. like that, when Prince of Persia, like the fucking dashing, on dashing and, and system, shine sparking and wall jumping you can and the then fighting as well, you know, so the game from this is absolutely up my alley. I'm a huge, I'm a huge fan of uh, this style of and cool art too. stage traversal. And, and combat. And then, yes, the original, which you played this, right? I have played this. Yeah. Mario's this is a great one. RPG Gino is officially back. The Super Mario RPG game is back with updated Notice how graphics. everyone wants Gino and no Let's one ever asks about Mallow. Returning. Never. <laughs> I was gonna, I was exactly gonna say, oh, two to characters, and we've been asking, nobody asked for this. <laughs> <laughs> Literally who? 
perfectly. You can now damage all enemies at once. And super surprising that they were not the smash characters. When it's full, you can unleash the three character triple move. Triple tech. Depending on your current party, like, this the is a move will change. So to me. No Gino and Malo ever in Smash? Because I think I think there were Square characters During your more adventure, than Nintendo. You'll encounter oh, bosses with colorful oh, personalities. That's, that's too bad. Or at least, like, you have to you can fight some of them again. request. And, and they got their, their costumes for me. Um, but these me, me up bosses oh, just, aren't going to be easy. Yeah. Same thing for Dante and, and a bunch of others. Like, if you were highly popular and requested, but, like... Set not big enough to actually make it into Mario the final roster. You got when to be Super a, a Mario me RPG outfit. launches on Sans the Nintendo so Switch on. system November 17th. Yeah, Pre-orders are available in France. When Super Sick Mario truck. RPG November 17th. I remember just you are Star Egg the shit out of that fight. <laughs> star Egg the yeah. shit out of that yeah, fight. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Fuck you, Culex. <laughs> Dave the Diver. So yeah, what is this? That looks cool. That looks new. Yeah, I saw I saw a screenshot. I don't Dive know. Dive and catch fish what it by is. day. Then serve them as sushi by night in the aquatic adventure cool. Dave the Diver. Use the fish you've caught to awesome concoct recipes style. and create the day's menu. Wow. Then tend to the clamoring customers at your sushi restaurant. Two games in one. Explore an ever-changing underwater world to find the best ingredients Yo. and strive to exceed culinary Yo, I expectations. I fought for the sushi, bro. Dave the Diver launches it's first delicious. for consoles on the Nintendo <laughs> Switch system October 26th. Is the best free orders and a free demo had. swim onto Nintendo. Somebody Wii Shop watched later Jiro today. Dreams of Sushi and and was inspired immediately. <laughs> Someone saw that that fucking movie and went, "Damn, what if a video game?" Yet as the world George, stands you've been consumed up to? by immense evil, a fallen prince shall rise again, ring of legend lighting his path. That is oh. the ring of the unicorn, ancestral treasure of Cornea's royal lineage. Legend speaks of huh. your ancestors wielding it to purify evil. we're going evil. back to what Vanillaware was about. Yet the answer is clear as day now. But the path holy before shit. us is laid bare, and all that remains now is to walk it. Walk it, I will, mother. So tactical. Tactic, tactics, but the combat Freely is vanilla wearing real hard. Expansive world. Yeah. Gather vanilla new Emperor. allies, forge your bonds, and lead the liberation to glorious victory. I mean, don't even show me the Cultivate overworld, Cultivate a grand right? army like, just with over 60 unique stick to, characters. Stick to this, even. From humans and like elves to, to massive face. beasts or and the dialogue angels. scenes. Today marks our first foray into the mists and probably of walking around town and, heavy over and probably home. like, you know, it may take days, uh, the food. months, mm -hmm. or even years. You always have but I shall familiar. see the duties but of also, my But also, I think because that that shit is insanely time-consuming and expensive. Wow! The what the heck is that? Yo! <laughs> Yo! What? How are you gonna print that every time? Oh my god! <laughs> Yo! Holy shit! What the heck are you? Never mind the game! <laughs> what the fuck with this crest, bro? Yo, I want this as a badge, man. Logo pop up! Put that on your chest. Never mind the game! That logo is sick! Yo, Colonel, Officer. Oh! <laughs> Yo! <laughs> George Kamitami reporting for duty. Oh! <laughs> Yo! Wow, <laughs> that's a boss. That is emblem. fucking clean, dude. Okay, Yo. okay, George, I see you. Where? Yeah, where of vanilla? The, ho the house of vanilla. The house of vanilla. <laughs> <laughs> Firstborn, protectors of the realm. Long may they reign. I, uh, I think. It's interesting to see their Presents games the rebirth figure of out. Fantasy RPGs. That's that is a that is a sentence. Yo. Unicorn Overlord. Wow. Available March eighth, twenty. We are talking mad shit. Okay. Uh, interesting choice too because this art style looks also a little less vanilla wary. I guess it's a little more flat with like the more anime look to it well they've, they've always done anime i mean i guess it's this is a different artist it looks like you know um the uh the way that they get around their budget limitations is very interesting because like 
this shit is gorgeous, but it's also limited, right? Mm. You can only draw like 20 of these backgrounds per game. And then you've got to use them over and over because it's just look how fucking nice it is. Yeah. And these sprites as well. So like, how are we going to turn this many sprites and this many backgrounds into a full experience? And so that's where I'm assuming the uh, this comes into play, right? This more simplified retro style overworld allows you to fill in yeah. a lot of the gameplay content and stuff without having to do the the the, the insane work. Um. 13 sentinels obviously plays around with revisiting the same locations and the timeline and the story and it only introduces new things after you go through the same places for a while you know uh, and then the battle mode is also abstracted in, in in you think about 13 sentinels combat you know but uh games like um uh uh oboro muramasa okay. and uh um um Dragons, not dra well. Dragons Crown. Crown as well. Dragons Crown, Muramasa, and uh, blah, 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 um, yeah, uh, Odin's Sphere. Odin's Sphere were really like uh, they didn't try to do. They didn't. They didn't separate you from the world as much. So, as beautiful as they were, a, a common complaint was people started started feeling like they were seeing reused assets too often. Yeah. So that's kind of. Uh, their solution this time around and yeah uh, uh it's probably a good one because the answer is either spend more money drawing more which again your artists are can only do so much it's the uh, it's the king of fighters 13 problem um you know plus time effort etc or find other ways right in each micro game you'll get into a specific wario won't move his boat form. quickly twist Copy grab the, the chair then perform the correct action as quick cool. as you can. Hand model. Okay, that could be fun. The micro games huh, will come really? one what after the... another, so look alive. Does it, does it have a, de a detector or something? Like, how did a hand thing work? Plus, up to four players can battle down know, in party actually. mode. Is it the goal without getting caught by Medusa? Detecting it's the IR Infrared? sensor? Wow. Or settle the score in an arena Impressive to be the last on one it. I didn't know to do that. Maybe it just over Yeah, maybe it's just like blocked or unblocked and it's just kind of assuming that you're doing that with Everyone's your hand. Everyone's in for a wacky time. I don't think Wario it's Wear move it. Launches hmm. on the Nintendo Switch. I mean, the WarioWare has done a bunch of shit that is as like quick as you can. pretty hand innovative hand but mold. Huh. The micro games will come one after another. That's so cool. Look alive. Yeah. I didn't know the IR sensors could could pick up that level of uh, plus hand fidelity. That seems to be it. All right. Dope. All right, Nintendo. Thanks uh, uh, for the microwavable food. I will make a note of Dave, Dave the, the Diver. diver.